In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to fix this issue with Outlook where you cannot delete the Outlook data file. In Outlook, when you first create it and logged in with your email, it creates a profile that is stored in Windows. So let's go ahead and open Control Panel. In Control Panel, you're going to find a option here called Mail. And for those who don't have this option, I've seen it that it could happen if you download an Outlook through the Microsoft Store. Um, right now I have Outlook installed locally in my computer, so many people will get this option. All right, go ahead and open that. And what you want to do is you want to click on Show Profiles. And this is the original profile that was created. So to get rid of this issue that you have here, you need to go ahead and remove the profile. Now keep in mind that you will have to re-enter your credentials and create your account again in Outlook. So that way you could load your inbox and all of that. So let's go ahead and remove the account. It's going to give you a warning because the information is cached and all of that will be lost so we'll click yes and then I'm gonna do add and then I'm gonna do a new one and I'm gonna name it something different so I'm just gonna name it Outlook and as soon as I did that it's gonna ask me for my email account so I'm just gonna go ahead and enter my name my email my password then continue and then I want to finish so now that I added this profile I'm gonna go to Outlook and I'm gonna close Outlook I usually do it through task manager it's much Simpler, simpler, and look for Outlook and end the task. All right, now that Outlook closed, I'm gonna go ahead and reopen Outlook. And there you have it, my email has been added. And that ha that's how you fix that problem. All right, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, leave your comment below and please subscribe.